Following a period of high tensions with China and a brief clash with Chinese forces, the Indian Air Force has begun to conduct night patrols using two of its most capable combat aircraft from forward bases near the Sino-Indian border. India currently relies on the MiG-29 UPG medium fighter and the AH-64E Apache attack helicopter to patrol the area. India's small fleet of AH-64E Apache helicopters is notably optimized for high-altitude operations and the aircraft carry considerably more firepower than their Chinese rivals such as the Z-10. The MiG-29 is also better suited to high-altitude operations than other Indian fighter classes and the Russian supply jets are capable of taking off from shorter runways than the heavier and more capable Sukhoi-30 MKI which is likely why they was chosen for operations near the border. While China also deploys the S-400 and a number of very high-end fighter classes such as the J-25 generation platform, all S-400s and J-20s are deployed near its west coast meaning its Western Theater Command which faces India is much less well defended. The United States has approved a possible $620 million upgrade package for Patriot surface-to-air missiles to Taiwan, the State Department says. The latest purchase from the United States to deal with a rising threat from China. Taiwan has requested to buy components to upgrade its Patriot missiles in order to support an operational life of 30 years, the State Department said. Lockheed Martin will be the main contractor, it added. Taiwan has been bolstering its defenses in the face of what it sees as increasingly threatening moves by Beijing such as regular Chinese Air Force and naval exercises near Taiwan. While Taiwan's military is well-trained and well-equipped with mostly U.S.-made hardware, China has huge numerical superiority and is adding advanced equipment of its own such as stealth fighters. A V-22 Osprey aircraft bound for the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force JGSDF, based at Camp Kizurazu departed Marine Corps Air Station, Iwakuni, Japan, to mark the official delivery of the first V-22 to the Japan Self-Defense Force. In May 2020, Japan has taken delivery of the first two V-22 Osprey tail trotter aircraft for the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force. In 2015, Japan has ordered 12 units of the V-22 and it was the first foreign customer of the Teltroder aircraft. More than 200 have been built by Bell Boeing and used by the U.S. Marines, Navy and Air Force. The V-22 Osprey is an American multi-mission, Teltroder military aircraft manufactured by the American company Bell Boeing. It has both vertical takeoff and landing and short takeoff and landing capabilities. It is designed to combine the functionality of a conventional helicopter with the long range, high-speed cruise performance of a turboprop aircraft. The Osprey is a Teltroder aircraft with a 38-foot rotor system and engine nacelle mounted on each wing tip. It can operate as a helicopter when taking off and landing vertically. Once airborne, the nacelles rotate forward 90 degrees for horizontal flight, converting the V-22 to a high-speed fuel-efficient turboprop airplane. The wing rotates for compact storage aboard ship. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you like the channel and want to support, please support on Patreon or PayPal. The details are given below in the description.